Joseph Emmanuel, and uh, this is his 2016 Suburban that we did a whole Brooklyn theme on. And uh, I'm gonna let you explain the- uh, The bags are the awesome. So I am from Brooklyn, New York, and I was like, well, how can I always take New York with me? This guy, <laughs> he put it together beautifully, um, along with the brick accents, the black wood, the cabinetry, even down to the wine rack. <laughs> I can't <laughs> complain at all. Nice. Yeah, so we uh, we went ahead and took his things that he wanted in there, which was black on black cabinetry, brick inlay, butcher block countertops, a microwave, a shower, fridge, sink, cooktop, pretty much everything you could possibly want for a Brooklyn loft. And we, uh, they were in a space the size of a suburban. I don't know how he did it, but this guy is a magician. <laughs> <laughs> He's a magician. Like, please. So let's do a quick walk around real quick and we'll just try to show you everything. Um, so the first thing he wanted was a hot water shower, which was kind of wild. So we took a hot tap here that runs off propane, put a hot water shower back here with 3000 watt inverter, fresh and gray water tanks. So that's a perfect little setup. And then we can come around the front. I'll show you uh, some more of it. So in the front, we got a butcher block countertop, a whole kitchen area with microwave, domestic fridge. To mention, you never have to plug in, ever. That's right. Yeah, you never have to plug in, ever. Everything runs off of solar, <laughs> solar, or if you're driving, the car basically runs off the alternator. Yeah. yeah. The fridge, you never have to turn it off. Off nope. the microwave. Yeah, I don't know how he did this wizardry, but this is <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> For sure. All right, thanks, All right. man. Appreciate it. Listen. All right, guys, so we're gonna get the bed put together. So first thing to do, pull this drawer out. This is on 500 pound slides. So you can put your entire body weight on there. There's also storage under here. Right now we have a toilet, but you can put anything that you want in here. And then you take these blocks that I made up and they just kind of go on top of here. They have little grooves that just kind of fit onto the drawer itself. And then that gives you your supports. And then you can take your mattress here and set it right in there. And then we'll go ahead and pull out the other side and we'll uh, put the whole bed together. This is a two part bed system. What you do is just pull the pin right here and you pull this out. And then you take these mattresses. Throw one there. And throw one in there. They fit nice and tight. It's a four inch memory foam mattress. And that gives you plenty of bed space. You got uh, over a six foot length in there. And I think you got about 40 inches width. The thing I wanna show you is all the storage that this thing has. Um, first of all, it has this big, nice deep drawer. This is a 40 inch deep drawer on nice, big, deep slides. And these, these slides are the, the heavy duty slides that can take a lot of weight. Um, of course, we got the one in front and we got the one in back. That one's a 16 inch drawer, this is a 40 inch. Then inside here, we have a garage, which underneath this garage is the S-Bar heater. And then behind here is places you can stick um, the jack. And then, you know, these are like the little tire holders and stuff like that, but you can put any kind of thing in here that you want to for garage space, tools, whatever, jumper cables. And then of course you have all your storage in here. This is nice, deep uh, bungee storage. You have a little tiny storage up here and then over here next to the battery as well, you have a little hidden storage right there too, where you can store some stuff as well. You got two extra storages in the front there as well. Cubby storage in there, as well as a cubby storage right here. And on top of the uh, countertop, you have a nice storage area for your spatulas, forks, spoons, whatever you have for your kitchen utensils and stuff. And right above here is your fan, which we can take that cover off and the fan will suck the hot air out or blow cool air in and uh, take care of you when you're sleeping. We also have these lights. These are uh, some reading lights, 
We've got one there, we've got one over here for the sink. And then when you want to drive, tuck it up up there, turn it off. Someone, a third person riding with you, you want to keep them safe. You can just simply use this seat belt. Of course, you'll have the cushion down here and you can put a cushion against the wall here. The thing I want to show you is this lagoon table. I have it kind of tucked out of the way here behind the uh, passenger seat, but we can pull this out. And we can take it back here. And it goes right on top of this, uh, on the bed frame here, slides down. And then now, you got a little table for the back of the uh, Suburban. Or if you're sitting on the uh, cushion here, once the cushion is up, you can also bring it in here and you'll have it for your little desktop. You can sit here, do computer work, all that kind of stuff, and uh, just move around where you want to. So, the man here, he, he built in an S bar heater. So I was like, well, it's gonna be freezing cold. How can I keep myself and my family warm? So, right here on the panel, right here is the s bar heater so how i was shown to turn it on you press once the time the temperature so let's just say that we want to adjust it it's off then we click it once then it's off on temp okay raise it up lower it go again the time we can go all the way to a full night's rest give it about about like five minutes to warm up thing I wanted to show you was this uh, cooktop here and you're probably wondering because it is a gas cooktop how we travel with out every bouncing around so I keep it in the foam here so um, this is like a travel foam that it can kind of travel in and then everything kind of just stays in here so when you want it out you pull everything out of the foam you set it up cook when you're done you're getting ready to drive the car put everything back into the slots here and then Simply just put it back into here. And now nothing will rattle around. Take your little cover, put it on. It's not balanced around. Same thing with the microwave too. We have everything, all the little turntable is in foam as well. But uh, that way nothing makes any noise. When you drive this thing, it's pretty soundproof and solid. Like nothing's rattling around, making noises or doing anything. So this is the hot water heater in the back of the Suburban. It's a hot tap. We got it hooked up to a small propane tank right here and a five gallon freshwater tank back here so not too much water but enough to take a small quick shower you simply just crank it on that gets the hot water going this cranks on automatically and you can adjust your temperature right here your water level right there but that gets a nice hot shower pretty quickly Um, this is the tour of the 2016 Suburban that we turned into a Brooklyn loft and Emmanuel is going to take a year-long trip in this thing so if you want to see this thing in action and what it's doing out there in the world and uh, in all its glory you can follow him on his YouTube channel I'll put the link below and uh, see him on his adventures I'm pumped <laughs> this thing is going to be all over the place sweet thanks guys